Hello guys, good afternoon. This is Chris coming to you from Crisp Digitals. Welcome to my channel. Welcome new subscribers and returning subscribers. And if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed, please hit the red button and hit the bell notification so you will be notified every time I leave or upload a new video on my channel. And please don't forget to hit the like button, the share button, and um, you know, leave some comments down below if you're interested in videos like this um so i just wanted to show you guys something i created i know some of you like to or you prefer i would say to create planner within your OneNote app and i've done series of um tutorials like this in the past but um somebody kind of you know hinted that they would like to see something that was created within note planner um one note planner excuse me so i've gone ahead to do something here and i did it for the month of july and um if you're interested in something like this please let me know in the comment section below so i can do a full tutorial with you guys for the month of august all right, so this is the month of July and I've gone ahead to do the week of 27, 28, 29, 30 and 31st. And the week of 27 has Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, which is four days in that week. The week of the 28 has five days in that week and so are the rest of them. Okay, so think this should have this one should be 26 and this will be 27 okay and this will be 29 all right so we'll fix those little um, mistakes there all right so let let me show you what this has so the week of 27 when I click on this see that it goes to the week of the 27th right here Okay. And the week of the 27 has, I have the days and schedules. So I have my to-do list. I have weekly workout. So it still has that. You can see it still has that four days in that week of the 27. So Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Also here, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And here it has that same thing there, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. And you, you have your meal plan here. You have your urgent and important notes here, and you have your notes here. Okay, so if you want to go to a specific day in that week, you can just go to Wednesday. Let's, for example, you click on that and look at what um, shows on that Wednesday. So you have my daily planner. So you are now on the Wednesday. Okay, and that Wednesday you have times here you have meeting and appointment and when you're done with them you can just check this as done check this as done check this as done also here for your workout you can have your um the list of what you're going to do that day for your workout so for example i just put abs tricep bicep legs chest cardio and treadmill so here you can put how many reps you can put how many if it's completed you can just check it and put how many reps for tricep and you can just check it and if you have to run uh, additional errands that day you can just put put it here and here is the water intake so eight ounce of water is recommended eight times a day okay so you can just check them when you um, complete a, a drink of water so you can just check them just like that okay so you need 64 ounces a day. So eight times eight, 64, right? So here you have your house chores for that day. If there is any, you put it. If there is none, you leave it blank. Here you have today's gratitude. What are you grateful for? You know, what do you appreciate about today? You can put it right here. And my top three, you can put them here. What are the top three things you wanted to do that day? Is it to read a book or ride your bike or visit a friend? Or watch Netflix whatever you want to do here you can put your top three there and you can just put when you complete them okay 
so this is a simple stuff that I created and you guys can also do the same thing so if I go back to the week of 27 and I go to Thursday I have the same thing here and if I go back again Friday so it's the same thing so a daily planner that's how it is so everything is the same in the daily planner but yours might be different based on what you have scheduled for your meeting so this can be removed and you can type in whatever you want okay and you can probably put um, work okay and this can be changed as well within your one notes planner okay and Saturday as well you can change that this could be you know mowing the lawn okay and you can check that all right which I just did this morning actually okay so um, you can go back again and you can go to July and if you want to do the week of 28 you click on that also and it takes you there I haven't link this yet to the days okay so i just wanted to show you guys you know what you can do if you notice the week of the 27 like i i mean the week of the 28 like i said before has five days so it's from sunday the fifth to saturday the 11th and if you look at the if you look at it it is sunday to saturday so it corresponds okay then i'll just change this as well this is just rough, like a rough sketch. I said, let me show you guys. If anybody is interested, you know, in creating this within OneNote, let me know in the comment section below, and I will do a step-by-step -step tutorial to show you guys exactly how you can create this and how you can link all this to them. Okay. So let me know. I will be glad to help you guys with that. Thank you for watching and remember if you've not subscribed please go ahead and subscribe because i'm subscribing now to the um, youtube channel and if you haven't joined the facebook group go ahead and join the facebook group the link is in the description below and if you're interested in planners that i've created you can go to my website down below and you will see planners that i've created and some of them i'll just show you some of the planners i've created are these and um, you see the other ones have the student planner something like this you know they are all on my website so if you're interested in that you can go to my website and you can get more planners all right thank you guys for watching and if you have any questions please leave me a comment down below and ask your questions i will be glad to answer all your questions all right thank you again and have a blessed day bye bye